What happened to this skull-cracking, people-exploding extended fight scene in The Flash? Apparently, it was just a little too R-rated for a PG-13 audience. The Flash was probably never intended to push the PG-13 envelope the way that some of the entries in the Snyderverse did. During an interview with Collider, Kaye was asked to dish about any noteworthy deleted sequences from The Flash. The silo scene was a lot longer. I did a lot of stunts for that scene. And some, I think, were a little too rated R, and they ended up kind of bringing it in. The scene in question sees Kaye's Kara Zor-El being rescued from a remote Russian prison. While she is weak and her powers are depleted when Barry Allen and company first find her, once she's taken outside and the sunlight hits her body, she regains her abilities and lays waste to the guards at the facility. Kaye didn't go into detail about what precisely made the deleted content too over the top for the theatrical version of The Flash, but it can probably be assumed that it was just too violent. 